Hey guys, Gaming Corn here. It's uh, 12.39 in the morning, but you know what? Um, I'm still gonna make videos for you guys because you guys like them. So, I got a lot of comments. I get a lot of comments now. Some of them are suggestions, which is cool. A lot of them are questions. I try to answer as many as I can. If I don't answer your question, I'm sorry. Um, I saw some dude answering some questions, so that was nice of you. Whoever is trying to help answer questions, because I get a lot of them. So thank you very much. But in this video, I will be going over the badges, what they do, and how to get them. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Alright guys, so the first badge I'm going to talk about is going to be the, um, the badge that you can get from the Blue Mushrooms here. And it's called the Home Run Badge. You can also get it from both different types of UFO. The UFO, um red ones i forgot what they're called because i'm stupid and then the ufo little people i also forgot what they're called don't make fun of me they're the little ones and the big ones they both can drop the home run badge and so can the blue mushrooms now if i drop this because i have it in my inventory right now it should say what it does for you guys more knockback more fatherly disappointment so i don't know what the last bit is gonna mean um Probably has something to do affecting a different stat, but it adds more knockback, which is very useful. So, I obviously use it. And now there's one that isn't really that useful, but I'm still gonna go over it, because why not? Okay, this next badge, the second badge, is from Robots, which can be found in both the Yellow and Blue Dungeon. Well, I don't know if I mentioned it, but Blue Mushrooms only spawn in the Blue Dungeon. And these badges are really rare drops. The Stoneheart badge, though, it's really bad, so I'm not using it. But what it does is you take less damage when you get hit, but you also go super slow. You go slower, which I think is really bad, so I don't use it. But it's a rare drop from robots, and if you... Don't take my word on it, then just go to the Discord and check the pinned messages. The last badge currently in the game, the third badge that I'm going to be going over, is called the Cactus Badge. I do not have this because it's very rare, and it actually started off as kind of like a leak at first. Uh, one dude had a picture of it in his inventory, and nobody else knew how to get it. But we started kind of guessing around in the Discord together. All of us were trying to like discover what it was from and eventually we found out we all concluded that it was from the wizard and that it was the cactus badge so if i kill this wizard here he's not gonna drop it it's super rare but it's from wizards and what it does is when you get hit it does damage to the enemy i'm not sure if it has a downside because i don't have it but it is in the game don't worry a bunch of people have gotten it if it seems like it isn't at times, these things are just super rare, trust me. So, those are the three badges, and obviously, you're gonna need a badge sash if you want to hold any of them. Which is gonna easily be crafted if you have two fabric, you just drop it here. Something I also want to show you. How are people getting a super help book? I'm trying so hard, like what the heck, oh my god. 